Okay, hello YouTube. It has been quite a while since I've uploaded a video. Uh, I still have my 84 F-150, but I also recently acquired a 95 F-150, just a plain Jane XL, regular cab, long bed with a camper on it, starting my mobile mechanic business back up again, so that is why I needed this truck. Um, the truck came with a six-cylinder, 300 straight six, with a uh, five-speed, the uh, Mazda M5R02, whatever the hell it is. Well, I wanted something a little beefier for when I get ready to tow a car hauler with a car on it. And I used to be a truck driver. I used to drive 10-speed, 13, 15, and 18-speed transmissions, so I kind of missed the good old days of grabbing gears. So what this monstrosity right here is, is actually two transmissions bolted to the uh, Ford small block bell housing. Now this bell housing originally came out of my 84 F-150 when it was a three on the tree. But it's just a standard uh, Ford small block bell housing. So it bolts right up to the granny four speed. This is a Borg Warner T-18 four speed out of an 85 or 86 Ford truck. I think maybe a F-250. Who knows for sure. Well, instead of bolting that straight to the bell housing, because by going from a 5-speed to this 4-speed, I would lose my overdrive. And that's where this guy right here comes in. This is an Advanced Adapters Ranger Torque Splitter, or Ranger Overdrive Unit. It says Ranger 3 on it. I don't know if that means it's the latest and greatest. I just bought this. Came in UPS on Thursday. I ordered it, I don't know, about three weeks ago, I guess. So it is brand spanking new. What it is, is a two-speed transmission. The lever back, that is direct drive one-to-one. -one. It's like that transmission's not even there. Move the lever forward, and you've got overdrive. They say it's a 27% overdrive. I think that's about a roughly a .78 or .76 overdrive ratio. Don't quote me on that. How this would work, you'd start out in direct drive here. You got your regular old Granny 4 speed. If you don't know about a Granny 4 speed, just real quick, it's 4 speeds. First gear is compound low, they call it, or Granny low. It is so low that for normal daily driving with a empty pickup, you start in second. Then you shift to third, then you shift to fourth, and that's all you have. Well now with this transmission, once I'm in fourth gear, I get up to freeway speed, I want overdrive, push the clutch in, push that lever forward. Now I'm in fourth gear overdrive. So I take a granny four speed and drive it like a four speed starting in second. So once again, I would go second, third, fourth, over. Now you can also use this as a gear splitter or torque splitter if you got a heavy trailer starting granny low direct then granny low over or first over now you got to come bring both levers back for second direct and watch this the way I got my shifters lined up boom they both come back at the same time because there's a little bit of interference right here if you will now we're in second direct second over this shifts a little tricky got it this lever has to go forward and this lever has to come back so real quick boom third direct third over now both levers straight back let me see if I can get this without now yeah, I messed it up a little bit take two we're in third over both levers back fourth direct get cruising up to speed you want overdrive fourth over this transmission moves around a little bit on this jack that's why I'm having a little issues so there you have it my eight speed Transmission, if you will. Two transmissions, two sticks. I love it. This makes me happy. I'll uh, take more videos later. I'll show you the new truck, the white 95 F-150. Matter of fact, right after I get done filming this, I'm going to film a video of the five-speed that's in it to show the potential buyer of that transmission that is a good, solid transmission. Shifts good, no noise, doesn't jump out of any gears. So hopefully I can get a fair price for it as a, when I post it on Craigslist. And until I see you again, bye-bye.